What's up guys, BlazerDB here with a quick tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you guys a little color correction and also the speech bubble effect, how to put it in your montages. So I hope you guys enjoy. Um, first thing you want to do is just go to Google and search speech bubble and you should be able to find an image like this with a little speech bubble. So just Google it, just Google and under Google images um, speech bubble and you'll be able to find it out, I mean find the image. So first of all, you just want to import your clip and make a new composition. Then we're just going to go over to, uh, say about, right, it's a good spot here. And now we're going to add our color correction. So I'm going to go down to Effect, I'm going to go to Magic Bullet Looks, and I'm just going to open Looks. And as we wait for this to load. All right, now that looks is open, we're just going to do some simple color correction. So we're just going to go up here to post, go down the curves. I'm just going to drag this down, drag this down, form some type of a wave just like this. And we're just going to drag these two up. And now we have our curves. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to um to mat and we're going to add a diffuse. And what that's going to do, that's just going to lighten up the scene. Then we're going to go down here to blue, to the full blue CB. We're just going to add that. It's going to add a nice little blue effect. And we're going to come over here. We're going to go to um, to lens and we're going to add a little edge and softness. And what that basically does is it blurs everything outside of this circle. So I'm just going to drag it out a little bit to about right there. So it blurs all that. And then we can just click OK. So now that we have our color correction working here, as you see, we're going to add our speech bubble effect. And this is real simple to um, to do. So we're just going to go layer, new, we're going to add a adjustment layer. And now we're just going to go file and import our, our speech bubble. So I'm just going to go to my desktop. Okay, speech bubble. All right, here we have our speech bubble. We're just going to drag it on top of the adjustment layer. So... Let's say I want my um, speech bubble to come in after he hits the game winning shot right there. I want a speech bubble to come in. Well, instead of. Oh, I don't even have my speech bubble click. Okay. So instead of just messing with the opacity and making it come in, you can basically just go up here to edit and just go to split layer and then just delete this bottom layer. And now the speech bubble just comes in when you um when he hits the game winning shot so now we have our speech bubble imported in our clip so now all we want to do is add a little simple text so we're just going to go up here move a frame over to where my speech bubble comes in all right now we're just going to go up here to um text so we're just going to create a new text layer as a matter of fact before i add this text i want to make the speech bubble a little bigger so go up here to my pointer to make it just a little Dig it and drag it up just a little bit. All right, now we're gonna go up here and add some text. So we go to our text tool. Um, let me use this font. Bye bye. Yeah, I'm gonna use that font. I'm gonna change my color to uh, just gonna use black. I'm just gonna type in tutorial. And now we're gonna move this down right here. And again, instead of messing with the opacity, we can just go up here to edit split layer 